According to what we learn of the structure of the Patsuf, it's impossible not to have connection between the Osh and the Guf. And the Guf brings deficiencies to to the Osh, and the Osh makes calculations and bring the Guf, the forces, the power to realize, fulfill the deficiency. That's what has to be this correspondence between the Osh and the Guf, and the Guf and the Osh. And this correspondence is called the action of dissemination. And it cannot come from the goof to the osh because the goof by itself cannot do anything. That's clear. But in the osh, you have several layers, let's put it this way, of the desire and the intention. There's a, in the osh, it's also a tense field. So there's a desire in the osh. Where they are all aimed at the Creator, only the Creator, down to about half of the Rosh, of Rosh, belong to the upper force. They identify with the upper force, they feel it. They're ready, they're destined to be adhered in it. But together with that, they're also destined to pass everything they have out of the love for the Creator. To pass out of love for the Creator, connection with the Creator, that's how they're built. They have this tendency. Seemingly not for the correction of the vessels, but they have the sense to pass it on to others in order to delight the Creator, because you can't do anything to him. You can't cleave unto him unless you are serving his plan, his desire. How else do you want to adhere to him, make your desires his? Then even work in such a way that they build it themselves in order to pass along the knowledge of the Creator, the plan of creation to these parts in the Rosh that receive it and then turn it from potential to practice. They turn it into such forms of abundance that can be received in the Toch of the Patsuf and begin to build the Toch of the Patsuf in such a way that it will be, it will resemble the Creator. The main thing is that the desires that are in, that are in the Patsuf, in the Toch of the Patsuf from Pe to Sium, will all acquire the form of the Creator. For them it will be in receiving in order to bestow. This is the goal. There's no place for Israel. It's an artificial thing. Artificial. It doesn't need to be part of creation. Only in order to bring the correction to the goof or the pursuit of the soul.